Good morning, my friends, or I guess it's good afternoon. Yes, I'm still ditzy. <laughs> I have been, I'm sorry, I've been gone for such a long time, it feels like. Been on a long recovery with my heart. And um, probably every one of you that know me know um, Alicia Wagman, Alicia's Crafty Hoplop. Um, and um, I have taken a lot of time off. Um, I needed some time for refreshing. I needed some time to recuperate. And um, I need some time to, to get myself well. And I still have a long, I've got a long lengthy recovery. I'm still having, I still have a lot of electrical problems. Um, I'm staying on top of them. Um, I'm taking, the doctor has had to double up my dose of my Cardizam for my heart. Um, like right now I am in AFib. Um, and I just took an extra dose of my Cardizam. Uh, and AFib by itself isn't necessarily a big deal. Although, you know, when it gets up really, really in the high, um, high range, you know, then it can be bad because what happens is and you have two chambers to your heart. You have the top chamber and the bottom chamber. And the bottom chamber is your atria, or the top chamber is your atrial chamber, atrium, and the bottom chamber is your ventricle, the ventrium, ventricle, or something like that. Anyways, the top chamber, when it goes into AFib, it starts quivering. Well, if it keeps quivering, it gives messages to the bottom chamber of your heart. Um, to start quivering instead of pounding like it should. And if it starts quivering, that's what sends you into cardiac arrest, which we don't want <laughs> again. So anyways, um, yeah, so um, I'm, being I'm being monitored real close and um, I'm very thankful for my cardiologists. I'm thankful for my friends and my family. I'm thankful for my husband, bless his heart. Um, the other thing is, um, I think I was kind of reaching a point of a little bit of burnout. Because um, I have a lot of responsibilities at home. Um, I'm trying to support my husband a lot more and help him out. And um, so... I'm taking things at a very slow pace. You'll see me on here periodically, but you aren't going to see me on here nearly as much. Um, maybe once, maybe twice a week. Um, I'm going to try to keep up on watching other people's videos as much as I can. Um, I love you guys. Oh, I really love you guys so much. Um, I've received so many beautiful cards and... Um, I've received a lot of pretty happy mail and, um, I just want to thank everybody who's reached out to me. So many people, so many people have reached out to me and, um, I want to really thank Alicia, um, for putting up that video and letting people know what was going on. And I want to put up a thank you to... Tammy Stamping Therapy. She's she's really done some amazing, wonderful things. She's been an angel to me, you guys. And I'll I'll make another video. She's she's blessed me like you would not believe. Um, during my recovery process, <laughs> my uh, friend accidentally. Well, I don't know if she broke it or if it just gave out. And it probably just gave out. Um, but my die cut machine died. My big die cut machine died. <laughs> which was sad because I didn't have the money to buy one. <clears throat> and really not sure where it was going to come from. And anyways, Tammy blessed me with a die cut machine. A brand new die cut machine. And I... I wept. I, I still, when I think about it, I cry. 
I'm so overwhelmed by her kindness and her love and her support. She's amazing. She's, she just gives. She's, she's such a giver and I intend on getting her back good <laughs> as best as I can. And I know she doesn't expect it, but she's going to get something back because she's just too kind and too generous and she needs to be rewarded for her, her generosity. And um, I received a lot of beautiful cards and some happy mail. Um, I'm just going to give, show you some of the cards I received. I didn't hang them up. I just wasn't feeling good enough to do it. And I've just been looking at them. This one comes from Bonnie Myers. It says blessings and she made it herself. Look how sweet this is. I just love it. And then she's got a sweet note on the inside. And she has this cute doily flower. I don't know if you can see that. This doily flower on the inside, just precious. Thank you so much, Bonnie. I'd so appreciate it. I'm going to put these in an album, I think. This one comes from Mrs. Ms. Rosemary Heister. Some of these people, I'm not even sure I know. Thinking of you, she's got this cute little uh, 3D butterfly, double layer butterfly with the corrugated cardboard and that, and the little flowers there. I love these kind of flowers. And then she's got a beautiful note in here. And, oh, I, I love it. Everything will be okay. Thank you so much, Rosemary. I really, if you see this video, I really appreciate that. And then we have one from Miss Susan T T T Tucker. She's another one I want to give a shout out to. But she emailed me and she's also sent me the Build It, Make It Beautiful Box Challenge. So I'm going to have to look up that video and make this. And she's got these cute little wontons in there, or fortune cookies with the fortunes on them. <laughs> Just quirky like Susan. I love it. And, okay, that's hers. And then we've got Helene Black. This is wonderful. See, these may be some people that have subscribed to uh, Alicia's channel. The world needs your voice. It needs your talents. It needs you. That is so beautiful. I love this. And then she's got a sweet message on the inside. Thank you, Helene, or Helen, however it's pronounced. Really appreciate that. Miss Glenda Arwood, thank you so much, doll. She's a sweet person. Very, very sweet. She made this card for me. Look how beautiful this. She's got diamond dust in the middle. She put a little blings, a couple little blings there. Get well soon. Stamped it. Very pretty card. She put a beautiful butterfly on the middle, a little sticker in there down below. Thank you, Glenda. Love it, love it. Uh, Julie Meserve, Sitford Heights, California. Very pretty card. She put vellum over the top. She made this thing up. Hello, with this felt butterfly. She's got little blings all over it. Just gorgeous. Thinking of you. Your crafty friend, the creative Chica. Thank you so much, dear, for sending that to me. I appreciate it so much. I've been looking at these cards over and over and over. This one comes from Sunako. Hey, Susan. Thinking of you. Look at this gorgeous card she made. So pretty. Hugs and blessings, too. Yes. She's awesome. Very beautiful. Very beautiful. And then she's got a little postage stamp on the back stamped by Susan Doctor, created by Susan Nocco. Thank you, Susan. Some of these cards had stickers and stuff in them. Like this one here, I believe did. This one is from Barbara Ford. Or maybe this one had the journaling cards. I used some of them already. Get well soon. <laughs> couple of cards that I, or not cards, but well, birthday cards that my husband, or not my, my husband, I can't remember, thank you Barbara, so sweet, I lost my train of thought again, this is a gorgeous one, this one comes from Sweet Paula, Paula Allen, Crafting by the Pond, Get Well Soon, this is a gorgeous card, She's got a beautiful message in it. Oh, love it, love it, love it. Hand stamped by Paula. Handmade by Paula. This looks like 
not Graphic 45, what's that other company? I love the company, but I can't think of the name of it. Gorgeous. Thank you, Paula. All of these cards meant so much. So, so much. And we have this other one, The Lord is My Shepherd. Love this one. This one had stickers in it. This one came from um, Becky Mer Becky Baker. That's right. She was my swap partner in July for the Christmas. Was it July? For the Christmas die cuts. Fortunately, I had most of those die cuts made up ahead of time. Marilyn, I said my prayers and my wishes. Yes, I love that card. So, those were taken care of. And then um, I received this from Sally Hendricks. Sorry, I've been kind of bad about just... Okay, that was something I bought. This was Happy Mail. And I don't remember who sent this to me. This was, I think, in one of the cards. But I don't remember who sent it to me. Oh, Sally sent this to me, I think. Yes. She sent me these. These cute little vintage images because she knows I love vintage stuff. Thank you so much, Sally. I love these. <laughs> Jolly Playmate in Picture Land. Oops. And then these are like just vintage cards, journaling cards. So I got those. <clears throat> those ones I bought from AliExpress. Then she sent me these gorgeous homemade flowers that she made. And Oh my gosh, I just love them. So we've got these type. Look how pretty those are. I just love them. And then we've got some of this kind of fibrous, gold, sparkly, vintage looking stuff. And you'll see it put into use in a minute. And then we've got some of these round kind of... They remind me of those puffy things that women used to make. The, the I don't know what they're called. They sew them. And they're kind of puffy. Look at that. Ooh, I love it. <laughs> and then there's two more in here. Just love these. Awesome, Sally. Thank you. Now, I'll show you what I mean by put into use. She made me this. Oh, my gosh. Look at this card. It's like a Oh, it's just gorgeous. So this is the front of it. See that? She's got all these. She's got the that fibrous stuff going down the back or down the side. Then she's got some gold twine or thread. Then she's got the flowers layered up. Then she's got some like burnt old paper that's stained. And then she's got some music paper that's kind of stained up. And then she's got this tea table picture. It's just stunning on this old, old looking card. And then she's got the letter in there that she wrote to me, plus another little flower. It's just gorgeous. I love this, Sally. I love it. Who knew? I, I had no idea that you did work like this. I love it so much. Sally, thank you so much. I am so blessed by this. And you better believe I'll use those flowers. Oh, yes. Oh, yes, 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 I will. Well, I wish I could think of those things. They're, they're round and they're puffy. Rolly, do rolly, oh, man. I wish I could remember the name of them. They're the coolest things. Yo-yo, yo-yos. Yo-yo, something like that. Somebody will know the name of them. It's not me, I guess. So I have those, and let's see, what's in here? Is this Happy Mail? Oh yeah, and this is Happy Mail that Sweet Tammy sent me. Oh my goodness. This is unbelievable. Look at this. The best, <laughs> this book. This book. Oh, look at this book. Oh my gosh. 
Look at this, you guys. Look at this. Look at all the beautiful. Oh my gosh. Look at this. Oh, I love this. I love it. I love this crinkle up seam binding. Look at these dangles. Oh my gosh. She's got one with an M on the end of it for my name. Look at the pearls and the crystals. And they're pink. My favorite color in the world. Oh, in green. I love it. Oh, and then she's got, oh, I didn't even see. Oh my gosh. How did I miss this before? There's a stick pin in here. Look at this. She's got a stick pin in here, right there. Ah, it's so pretty, and all this lace. And then she's got, I think this is the Bird Waltz paper from um, Blue Fern. Yes, it is. It's the same paper, the same one. She actually bought me that paper. So I can make an album or something with it. The best, the best, most beautiful things cannot be seen or even touched. They must be felt with the heart. Helen Keller. And then she put this gorgeous cameo on here. Oh, Tammy, I just love this. Every time I look at it, I just swoon over it. Look at this. And look at the pink lace down below. You got pink trim here. You've got this pocket. pocket. And you got this pull out, you pull it out. There's this cute little notebook. Look at this. And it's got the lace on it there. Thinking of you, sweet friend. It's got a sweet little message in here. Tammy, this is so cool. I've never had a book. I've never had a book. Well, I had that little teeny one that you made for me. But the, I mean, I've never had a big book. I guess that's what I should say. I have never owned a big book. This is so cool. Many people will walk in and out of your life, but only true friends leave footprints in your heart. Eleanor Roosevelt. I'm going to keep this thing forever. I love this so much. This is so gorgeous. Two book tags. Bookmarks, I mean. Yeah. Got another pocket here with two more. One... Oh, there's actually four. Four of them. That's awesome. You can journal on the back of them. She's got more of that pink lace. I love that lace. And then more here. Put that there. Footprints. Many. P oh, he spoke. My precious child, I love you and would, <clears throat> and would never leave you. When you only saw one set of footprints, that was when I carried you. Wow. Oh, and then she's got the thread thread or the seam binding going through there. She's got more of that gorgeous lace across the top there. Here she's got friends make life sweetest, sweeter. More of the pink lace. And then here, I love this. I love this glassine envelope. I want to know where you got that. I haven't been able to find glassine envelopes. She's got these cute little journal things. In, or not journal, but these little uh, sticker type things, which I love. And then she got a bag of tea in here, English breakfast, which is actually my very favorite tea. How did you know that? I love English breakfast tea. And then we've got another bookmark here with music pages on it. It's a little bit taller. And I love the way she did this page at the bottom, the way it's not straight across. I love how it comes up like that. And it has this bluebird on it. Love bluebirds. I went to Montana and that's all I saw were bluebirds. Another bookmark there. This is so cool. More of the pink lace. This is lace all the way through it. This is so much me. I love it. More of these sweet little pictures. You know, I could use these. I could actually put them on cards. I don't know if you want me doing that or not. Look at this. <gasps> she made me one of those cabochon things. Oh, and it's got like crocheted yarn around it. Sorry, I'm not even showing you guys. And then we've got a package of these jemmies of pearls. Oh, wow. And these are from Stampin' Up. Boy, they get tiny. 
Wow, I don't know if I can even hold those tiny little things, but I'm going to try. <laughs> Tammy, and then this is the back. This is just gorgeous. Tammy, thank you so very much. You guys, <laughs> we have a wonderful community here. We really, really do. And it's sad that I'm not going to be able to be on here quite as much, but I've got to take care of myself, and I just, I have more responsibilities at home, and family comes first, and my life comes first. But I love every one of you, and I'm going to support every one of you the best I can, and I hope that you guys will still support me the best you can. And um, I just want to thank everybody again for all the love and the support, and I've missed you so very, very much. And um, I will talk with you later. I've got more things to show you, but for the time now, this is what I'm going to show you and tell you, and I love each and every one of you. All right. God bless. Bye-bye.